Hello and welcome to this week's episode of No Resets. Uh, my name is Dwight and we are once again playing Super Mario 64. As you can see where we left off, we had 31 stars. We had just beaten Bowser um, in the first world and we got the key to the basement. So today I figure I'm going to go ahead and start on the basement. Um, cards on the table. I didn't actually look up anything in between, so I'm still not 100% on this one um, for the hundreds coins. I'm just going to tackle it when I get to the last one, which I know I need the metal cap for. Maybe we'll do that today. Okay, so to the basement. Or, no, oh, we'll start with Boo first. That's right. This is technically a part of the the basement stuff. This is, as far as I'm concerned, it's the, uh, the next phase of the game. I stand by this game was so creative in how it, go on a ghost hunt, in how it, um, come on in here. <laughs> okay. In the ways that it hit its levels, it was just so cool. So, um, between the last time I recorded and today, uh, so I edited all of my videos uh, in one main batch last time. And uh, when I was doing it, I didn't catch a mistake that I made, which I did catch uh, when I was editing the first round of um, Tiffany and Dwight Ruined Games. I know there's some booze in here. I thought you are supposed to kill the booze. Yeah, there they are. Um, and that was, oh shit, something about die, he he he, can you get out of here alive? Oh, ghosts don't die. Okay, that was it. Um, I, I mislabeled the date because when I created the template for, uh, the sidebar thing that I have, um, I did it in 2018 and I didn't update it because it was such a small part at the bottom. So... Sorry about that. Know that they were recorded and edited in 2019. Everything going forward from here on out should be acceptable. But if it's not, eh, I'm only human. So. Ghosts, don't die. My cat's sitting next to me, um, biting his nails or his claws. So if you can hear that, I apologize. I'm not going to tell him to. Boo. Haha, <laughs> literally. I'm not gonna tell him to stop, because who am I to say what he can and cannot do? I doubt it's coming through anyways. <sighs> so let's go ride this elevator back up. Although I could do the boo while I'm down here, but I've got those other ones mostly done, so not really worth it. Not worth my time to waste your time. Ah. It's a he, Mario. I feel like there was something else that I wanted to talk about, but off the top of my head, I can't. Oh yeah. Um. So I've been really enjoying this. <laughs> surprise, surprise. Um, I've gotten really into it, I think. Uh, it's been fun just kind of messing with all the youtube -y stuff that can be done. God, no! Twice! It's been a while since I've done this. Like, uh, discovering how to, like, do, like, the end card stuff and all of that little, um, video producer -y things, which has been enjoyable for me. So... I don't know. I hope you're enjoying it. Uh, I have already picked out the next game uh, that I'm going to do. It's another... It's a Super Nintendo game. Uh, it's an RPG. It's one of the more famous ones. Uh, and it's going to be a long one. Um, it's a game that I've, I've definitely played. And I have... I think I've beaten it. But I don't think I've beaten it by going through the entire thing. I've either like watched somebody else beat it. Or I um, did a thing where I kind of jumped to the end with a strong team. Oh, I guess I can just get the boo to come over here. Okay. 
Come on. Come and get me. Oh, or I can just get it right there. Boom! Here comes the Master of Mischief. The Tower of Terror, the Big Boo. Ha ha ha. I love King Boo. I think that's what this guy is modeled after. Well, no, King Boo is definitely from Super Mario World. Wow, that was weird. Maybe he's not from World, but Big Boos were from Super Mario World. That was, uh, the hitboxes on that was nuts. In a weird way. Like, they, they were huge. What a cool angle. Alright, let's keep this up. Oh, you do have to kill it every time you go in. If you do a backflip, it makes a double, uh, double flippy noise. It's like, I like it. All right. We. How many times do you kill Big Boo in this section? Three? Because I feel like I kill him again here. Alright, hit one. <laughs> that was fun. Two. Not too shabby. It's amazing how some of them go by really quick. <laughs> like that one took me like a minute. And some of them, I fall and I fall and I fall. Alrighty. Oh, um, the other thing I was saying. Uh, so the last time I feel like my controller was um, being a little wonky. I, I'm not 100% sure if it was the controller itself or just all in my head, um, but I've swapped controllers. I'm actually using my very original Nintendo 64 controller, which is kind of neat and makes me happy. All right, secret of the books. Um, top? Bottom? Middle? That makes sense. It's been a while since I've done this, but really easy patterns, really simple patterns. Boom. Got it. Another one done. I'll probably go for the hundred coins when I have to go to the um, roof. Because. I know there's a bunch of stuff upstairs, and I'm not 100%. I don't remember when I have to do things. Or hate red coins. Oh, I don't remember where these are at all. I feel like they're all in the house. Are they? Is there one out here? No. Am I gonna do 100 coins now? Is there one back here? Maybe we're just doing 100 coins now, because why not? Apparently I. Oh, jeez. Oh, no. Oh, I got him. Right. Yeah, there's ghosts in here, but is there a red coin in here? I know the only way to get in here, normally, is with the invisibility cap, which I have not unlocked yet, obviously. I didn't play anything in between um, the last couple of, or the last session. Um, for this type of game, I'm definitely not going to. When it comes to stuff like the, uh, the RPGs, I don't know if I will, because... Um, when it comes to like leveling up and grinding, that could be really boring to do on camera. 
so I don't know if anybody wants to see that. I might like impose a rule where all I do is like sit in one spot. I know there's a red coin back here, right? Yeah. I might just sit in one spot and um, deal with. Oh jeez. And like do the stuff that that way. Like oh, I only stayed in this one area and ground for three levels to get myself up to 15 or something. Because that's not something people need to see. So, for example, if I ever do, like, Final Fantasy 2, like, um, and I, I always, whenever I play that game, or sorry, Final Fantasy 4, um, but I always, when I play that game, I always, like, sit out in the field when you start the game and grind up to, like, level 5 or something, just to make the first dungeon easy. That's not something anybody needs to see. Unless you really want to. If you do, uh, let me know. Well, I needed to go down here anyways. Do the ghosts... Oh, the ghosts might not appear. I hope they do. Okay, good. Because that would have been... Frustrating. Because that's 20... Oh. 30? 30? that's a lot of coins that I would not have wanted to have missed. Yahoo! Man, I really missed this game. I really missed the N64. I don't know what. There was something about this era of... 3D gaming that was just felt like so honest in its gameplay and discovery because people were still trying to figure out what they could do. Now you can do basically anything. Which I'm not saying that's bad, but it's definitely. nothing in here that's right see I don't remember everything about this game and I lost my train of thought so I apologize uh, jump yeah oh well how many more do I have left four if I have four left that might have been four I don't remember if that was four or five. Oh, okay yeah, we're, we're there. Hey. Need to catch your eye. Ha! See what I did there? That was clever. Clever, clever, clever. Uh, no! Oh, don't smush me, please. Ow. Boom. Collected a hundred coins. Yes, I want to save. There should be more. Is there just the one in here? Okay, there's two. So got two more to go. Um, oh, there's two in here. There are two. Two books. All right, there's a f that flips. I gotta be careful with that. Unless that fl So I think the last one is directly below me. Yeah. Should have just done that before. <laughs> you try to be fancy and do it the way it's intended, and then. Just do what feels right, I guess. Kaboom. Alright, making good time. Lots of coins, lots of one-ups. I am a little sad that my one-ups didn't carry over from before. But, not super necessary. Alrighty, big booze balcony. 
you know, we're at a point where we're doing like a, uh, a world and episode. I guess part of it is because I know it so well, but can I just backflip up there? No, okay, so I need to do a wall stuff. I guess what I'm trying to say is, for right now, Um, we're going quick. Oh yeah, I didn't even hit this last time. No, it's only 20. We're making good time, and we're finishing a lot of these. I wonder if the later ones are going to be more, um... Do I have to climb on the roof to get this one? Yeah. Oh, this is scary. Later episodes might have more. Ah, oh, damn. Well, you're in for a long episode now. <laughs> Later episodes, what I'm trying to say is, might be longer. Or, not longer. Um, I might have to split worlds, like a click clock talk or tick tock clock or whatever the harder ones are. Rainbow Ride. The Rainbow Ride ones, there's ones that take like. 10 minutes, but... Somebody's backing up outside. I can hear beeping. Okay, what's the best way to do this? Is it to try and get up onto that roof? Is it just go... S Whoa, that could have been bad. Is it just go straight out? Like... Oh, come on. Come on, come on, come on. Ah, how am I supposed to do this? I don't remember how to do this. Also, apparently I'm going to die. Bounce, bounce, bounce. Isn't there a heart upstairs? Or is that behind that other door? I'm going to do more than one in a... Episode, he says, as it takes him forever to get one single star. Oh, come on. God damn it. This is frustrating. Feedback. Um, when I'm doing something like this and I'm repeatedly failing, is that something that you would like to see left in an episode? Is that something you would like to see cut out because it's repetitive and you just want to get, have me get to the point where I actually make it? God, oh shit, again. That's how you can stop taking fall damage though. Is that something you would like me to do? Would it be more beneficial to cut this I'm leaving it in this one as uh, just so I can ask the question. I'm not running fast enough. Barely made that one. You know, if the camera didn't lock into this far away thing, and if I could actually see, you know, if these shapes weren't super muddied, can I backflip up there? Nope, that was... Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. That was just a big beef. Okay, so we made it up onto that. Damn it. Okay, okay, I think I got it. So if I run up to the angle up there, so we're up here, I got this. I feel like there's a way to like get onto the top of the roof, but there definitely isn't. Come on, oh shit.
Okay, here we go again. All the way over. All the way up. Damn it! You're telling me, Mario. All right, again. Zoom. That was weird. Maybe this way? Should I try going this way? <laughs> I did it! All it took was one way or the other way. Okay. Whew. That was an adventure. I came up with an idea halfway through screwing that up repeatedly. I hope you enjoyed it. But I am leaving in my commentary about how you would like me to handle things like that. I think my solution will be elegant. Oh, I can't do this. I die in the secret room. I can't do that. Okay. <sighs> so, to the basement. So I came up with an idea on how to handle that, and I'm sure I did it relatively fine. Here we go. Hold on. I think there's text here. Nope. Cool. Um, so... I came up with an idea on how to do it, but my issue is uh, the computer that I built for myself here at home, I did it uh, a couple years ago, and when I did it, I just did really um, basic needs stuff. Um, it's not really built for computer editing, so I have, I'm have i going to be getting a new uh, graph, uh, processor and motherboard soon for personal use, but... Um, It makes edits like that hard. So, I won't be able to do things like that that much if I'm editing at home. Okay. Let's get, I think his name is Nips or Mips. The trick to getting him, I remember, is getting him to a corner. Or a, a dead end in a corridor. That was the easiest way to get him. No. I wasn't diving. That would have been it if I was actually... Got him. Haha. <laughs> Around corners in general. Yow! Unhand me, brute. I'm late. So late, I must make haste. This shiny thing? Mine. It's mine. Finders, keepers, losers. Late, late, late. Ouch. Take it then. A gift from Bowser. It was. Now let me be. I have a date. I cannot be late for tea. Here we go. Wow, another power star. Awesome. Go grab the hidden toad one. I don't want to punch you. Jump. It's jump, not punch. Hold on to your hat. If you lose it, you'll be injured easily. If you do lose your cap, you'll have to find it in the course where you lost it. Oh boy, it's not looking good for Peach. She's still trapped somewhere inside the walls. Please, Mario, you have to help her. Did you know there are enemy worlds inside the walls? Yep, it's true. Bowser's troops are there. Oh, here, take this. I've been keeping it for you. I'll take it. Wow, another power star. This is the episode of Chump Stars. No, not Chump Stars. All right. 
I might as well go get the other cap while I'm out here. Can I get both caps? I don't remember where to get the metal cap. Oh, you get the metal cap from Hazy Maze Cave, that's right. I remember now. Okie dokie. Drain the moat. Yep. Okay. Welcome to the Vanish Cap Switch course. All the blue box you find will become solid once you step on the cap switch. You'll disappear when you put on the Vanish Cap, so you'll be able to elude enemies and walk through many things. Try it out. All right, let's make these jumps count. So the first one I saw was right here. I don't think I missed one up there. I might have. Where's the next one? There's a one-up directly below us. Let's get that. So, oh, you're kidding me. I hope I didn't miss that first one. So when I was um, practicing before I started actually recording, this is a... Uh, weeks ago now at this point. This was the course that I um, just immediately jumped into to practice my, my movements and stuff like that because it was right out in the courtyard. And I got stomped because I hadn't played in forever so I did not know, you know, Mario's movements very well. I just wasn't familiar with the, the feeling Take it. And... I, I feel like I missed one up top. Yeah, I definitely did. Ah, oh, that's that's frustrating. Ugh. Step on the vanish cap switch makes vanish cap Mar makes Mario disappear. Now vanish caps will pop up in the blue box. I like to save. Yes. And I don't think there's a way back to this to the top. Without, um, unless, like, that, this does it, which it might, that'd be nice. No, I guess that just kills you. Darn it. This is the episode where I just beef everything. Okay, so... Yep, there's one right there. So, now we know. There. 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 Okay. Much better. On our way. Hmm, back to this difficult part. Whoop. I think I like that jump because it's so controlled. Like, I, I can... I have a lot of control over it in the air. And, like, I know where it's going to end and the trajectory of it just feels... good. At least that was quick. All things considered. So I don't know how much time I edited out. I probably have time for... No, that's a good spot to end it, I'm sure. That's probably not a bad place to end for this episode. So, um, thank you for watching me through my trials and tribulations this week. Um, this has been another episode of... Uh, no resets. Uh, I have not reset yet. Well, that's not true. I did in between. But um, once again, thank you for checking this out. I hope you're enjoying it. Um, 
I, we have a podcast, No Refunds Podcast. Uh, you can email us questions or leave a comment um, on this video. And please, you know, subscribe. I, I learned how to put the subscribe thingy up. Um, I know most of you who are probably watching this already are. So it means a lot. It's really cool and really fun. So thank you all for, uh, for hanging out. And I'll catch you guys next week with... Uh, we're probably going to go to um, the sand world and maybe the lava world. Who knows? I know those ones pretty well. All right. Um, talk to you later. Bye.